While you were freaking out that Nintendo really did make a PlayStation hybrid, you probably missed the smartwatch maker for all, the robot record we love, and tiny drones teaming up. Welcome to In Case You Missed It, where this drone getting creamed by a pumpkin launcher is all the spice I need in my fall latte. Mm. Researchers from the Human Media Lab at Queen's University have bridged the digital divide with physical drones that display digital information. These tiny quadcopters, called bit drones, can work together to create a real physical hologram. Bit drones and users are tracked through a Vicon motion capture system. It reports coordinates to a computer, which sends thrust commands to control each drone. They come in three varieties, pixel drones, which have a basic LED display, shaped drones, which are surrounded by wire cubes that create a physical display, and display drones, which act as flying touchscreens. Together, they can be moved around, creating a buzzing 3D interface that makes them the Voltron of the sky, aka run for your lives. Go Voltron Force! Some Chinese engineering students set a new world record for furthest distance covered by a quadruped robot. It also set a record in my heart for being the best tall drink of water bot I've ever seen. The robot traveled more than 83 miles over the course of 1,405 laps of an indoor track. The robot had to complete the trip on a single charge or tank of fuel per the Guinness guidelines, which it did easily, beating out the previous Cornell nerd record holders at 40.5 miles. Every time it steps, it's like, wee, wee, look at it, so cute. Let's be real, I am not about to drop $1,700 on the 18 karat gold Apple Watch, because of course, that's my favorite one. But now you can be just as pompous as your moneyed friends with the new Trivoli. It's a disc that goes underneath your existing watch, turning it suddenly into a smart device. How smart? Yeah, go ahead and pull it through. Thanks, bud. Decently intelligent. The Kickstarter video shows it controlling your smartphone camera, cranking up music, and there's a heart rate monitor to sync with your fitness app. It vibrates to alert you of other app notifications, and so far, it's way cheaper than the competition. And now, Too Long Didn't Read, where we do the reading for you because it takes a team of us to understand all these stories. NASA reopened its space program to new astronauts with applications opening next month. The EPA discovered a defeat device in more Volkswagen TDI engines. Twitter changed its star icon to a heart. CBS is bringing back Star Trek, but only if you pay for the network streaming service. Comcast announced plans to cap internet usage in the South. And the first full Warcraft movie trailer debuted, and shut-ins made plans to leave their homes for the first time ever in June. Just kidding. They'll find an illegal copy online. Have a good weekend.